Today is the project called the M. This is one of the very high-end condominium project at the Middle Road. It catch my attention during the circuit breaker. It's come out to be the news that is three blocks of 20 story and one block of the six story common using facility and the construction currently currently and the target to finish by year 2024. Located at the middle room, a middle road then neighbor building got the National Library and as well as Bugis Junction, uh, Shaw Tower, so on and so forth. The nearby MRT is Bugis MRT. Good location, price will be good. This building, uh, the contractor is adopting a silent smaller system uh, using the precast four bar. Uh, in the photo, this is doing the uh, ULT ultimate load test to check the barring design whether it can cater for the 20 story building. Uh, this is one of the barring machine, boring rig, and it seems that they already got the water turned on. So uh, this kind of the heavy duty netting can eliminate or reduce the chance of the flying objects. So uh, this kind of safety netting or good practice. So uh, when the building go higher, so the safety netting they use to uh, cover the whole area. Which, which in the photo we can see is quite well covered so all the construction floor is being protected mm -hmm. 
once the once the bottom structure is being done up so uh, which just now we see from here going up so the next one will be casting a transfer deck which is in this portion then after that on top is something like a lego one story two story three story four story just counting and going on all this kind of the unit is a pbvc system fabrication of offset then just the bring to side and the whole thing So uh, in order to hoisting uh, one element that is critical, which is called the tower queen. In this photo, there is tree number one, two, tree number of the tower queen, uh, which used the two hoisting the PPVC unit, like a Lego box. Like this is one piece, like this is one piece. It's just stack up and up. Uh, the theory is very simple, but uh, the connection detail is very challenging. So most of the time. The contractor have to spend a lot of the effort to convince, convince the structure engineer to accept the connection details. So when when once the learning curve is done up, the the structure can be going up very very fast. So in this photo, I uh, just not one tree building, but this one, one, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8. This kind of typical flow can even achieve uh, 2 or 3 days when flow going up. But after going up, that one is mainly for the carcass being fixed. There's still a lot of the connection and the leveling as well as the touch up work to be done. So uh, these contractors they have came up with this very unique of the external safety screen which is to using to uh, to make the canopy area is be ready so uh, this is also some kind of the safety screen to using for the construction so uh, in this photo this is a transfer plate which can be seen very clearly below is the core wall and the columns that are supporting it one thumbs up point is all the windows that, that be looks very clean and uh, very neat. Thumbs up to the conductor. So uh, this is a blow up photo of the of the temporary working platform being used. So uh, once it's moving up progressively, we can see below floor. This is number one, two, three. The high risk job is finished. It's all being protected with this heavy duty safety screen. Okay, so it's continue going up, follow up the core wall, and we see on top the column and the, the core wall just continue going up. Uh, one, one more the good point is all the wall is being very neatly finished thanks to this uh, safety screen, external safety screen. So all the all the facade wall can be finished. We can which we can see the is either a permanent uh, a permanent finishing or there will be some coating which can be done easily future by gondola. So this is good practice to get all the facade wall try to finish in one step instead of come back and rework and redo. Uh, another learning point is the core, the core wall can be going up quite high. So this is actually the construction floor. So you see the core wall, how many floors going up higher. So we can see at least one, two, three, four, five, six floor higher than the slab construction floor. By adopting the system homework, this is the benefit that uh, to let your core wall to be constructed ahead of the slab, which can save the space and uh, reduce the critical pass. Okay, so with the building going higher and higher, finishing being done up, so everything being tidy up. So look forward to the completion of this project, thanks everybody.